Hey, this is Scott with the Scotch Malt Whiskey Society, and you're looking at cask number 108.44, Left Field Peat. This is a nine-year-old Speyside, bottled at 66.1% ABV. Our aging cask for this was a second fill X bourbon barrel, and it's within our peated flavor profile. I decided to go tropical with this one. We have about six inches of snow outside. It's February 2nd, and I thought, Let's pretend we're somewhere nice. Let's see what we get on the nose. Ah, earthy, milder peat. Darker, sweetness notes here. Not necessarily citrus sweetness jumping out at me. Milder peat, little more earthy, darker. See what we get on the palate. Woo, 66.1%. Man, that's showing. That's setting the burn in. We got nice peat here. Not a lot of peat. <clears throat> more earthy tones here for me. More kind of soil. Even a wet log in a, in a forest that you may find. Uh, a little bit of humidity, dampness. Not necessarily the lighter citrusy fruits here jumping out at me. That earthy peat, milder. There's a sweetness here, but it's more, almost more of a darker, darker brown sugar sweetness. Not necessarily fruity, more caramely, more fudgy. Hmm, it's nice. Man, these whiskeys at 66% pack a punch. Beautiful palette on this one. Richer, a little darker, a little deeper. Little peat is still good here. Um, this is on the low road, I would say, is on the lower end of our uh, peated uh, profile. You've got lightly peated, peated, and heavily peated. And I think this is, as far as our peated category goes, is probably on the lighter side there for it but still above lightly peated. Let's see with a drop of water. Water brought out more sweetness right up front. More of those brown sugars. I would even say a little bit of a mushroom, uh, like a brown mushroom portobello hints in there with it. That soil, wet soil, that damp, woody forest after it's been raining. Hmm. Interesting and nice. Another drop of water. This one will probably take a few drops of water. Don't be afraid to bring this one down. Especially at the 66.1% ABV. I'm getting some toasted marshmallows. Almost a s'more, like graham crackers, some dark chocolate, burnt marshmallow. Two drops of water now. Hasn't hurt this a bit. Still high ABV. Um, this is going to be a good one to play with and even look at as the bottle uh, is open for a while. Let's see what we get for tasting notes. Bright, brittle, and a curious mix of sultry smokiness with fiercer and fear notes of chili, hot coals, and roof pitch. A peaty curiosity. Left field peat, 108.44 is available on the website for $100. Remember, Scotch Malt Whiskey Society whiskeys are not for swigging, glugging, or knocking back. Please drink responsibly. Salancha. So